Welcome back. More Breath of Fire 4. Yesterday, I streamed <clears throat> about two hours. Towards the end of the stream, uh, Just Ass <laughs> was helping me out, which was super dope for him, you know, coming in and helping me out. Um, but since I'm streaming on a old 1960s IBM, or at least it seems like, um, whenever the kids spread apart to go play hide and seek, um, my CPU decided to jump inside a fresh, uh, boiling toilet and, uh, kind of crap out. So, what I've done is I went ahead and I did all the, um, the kid catching and got them and then basically we're just starting on from from then uh, we're still in Sinesta nothing changed there I just want to make sure you know that's the next thing I'm supposed to do so uh, which is weird Whoops. I did test stream after or I did a test um, after all that happened and I rebooted the system and rebooted the uh, uh, the stream and all that stuff and it, it went back fine again so I don't know, maybe it could have just been a hiccup. Um, Cause like right now it's it seems to be running fine. So, but I do have to say the kids are all, have all been picked up. So that could have been it, who knows. We're gonna go in here and we're gonna talk to the uh, orphanage lady. There's a guard to make sure no one goes underground, but Chino probably got past them when he was getting a drink of water or something like that. That's the other thing, I didn't get Chino, because that's where we're supposed to go. That's right. This music is insane to me. It's just absolutely bonkers. So up here was where I was supposed to go. What? One of the orphans went down there? That's impossible. I've been standing here watching the entrance all day. Or are you saying that I'm not doing my job? <laughs> that was funny. Whew, I'm really thirsty now after all that shouting. So, can I go? Well, I'm sorry. Can yeah, it did. It did. But you're. So I gotta get you a drink now? So you're gonna totally ignore the fact that they're could possibly be a kid down there <clears throat> in a place infested with monsters and you won't let me go by how how great a person you are um so now I'm off to find some water for this dude I guess supposed to go get water from stream just went out or if Twitch on my phone just went out and I have no one this this person kind of bothers me right right here Yeah, got nothing to say. Um, interesting. There we go. <clears throat> I don't know if, if stream just kind of went in the toilet there, or what, what happened? So, if stream did go in the toilet, uh, I'm looking for 
water, I guess, for that guy that won't get out of the way. Water. Get your cool, clean water here. I wonder if he'll buy water again today. Ooh, that's a hint. I hear that Imperial troops sometimes come here too. Well, if you want to give somebody water, come over here and give water to the, to the guy that won't get out of my way. This house belongs to the magnificent Warlock. It's not a place for people like you to hang around. <clears throat> oh, go up the stairs. Aha! Of course, now they're blocking the way, so I gotta go around. Uh, slow down. <coughs> Sorry, I clear my throat there. There we go, finally. I get to get in here. Okay. Going down some stairs, looks kinda spooky. encounter. Let's see what we got. <laughs> Those are some big cockroaches. I look like some some cockroaches we have down here in the south. They get big. <laughs> I don't know if there's any uh, learnable moves either. Black John, whoop whoop. Alright, what's going on, just ass? Uh, so I finally got by the guy with the whole water issue. Um, earlier in the stream, I was explaining after stream died yesterday, I went on and found all the kids and did all that stuff and then um, uh, just continued on from there just to get that part out of the way. Hopefully it doesn't happen again. I have a feeling it will, but hopefully it doesn't happen again. So now we're in the sewers or in the whatever area that is. I had to get the guy some water. Nothing in this room. Yeah, I'm looking for Chino, yep. I'm so glad you taught me how to like learn moves because now I'm like trying to make sure I, I do that. Those are mice. I had a feeling the tox flies got something that he could he could do, like poison or something. Still need to learn the fire spell to make that combo right. Is do you know if there's any enemies that are close by or in this area that know that fire spell or a particular fire spell that can uh, let me learn that combo? He left. Figures. What I should have done to see... Let me go back real quick. Is there a shop in town to see if I can buy some items? Because I really need to buy, you know, items that you survive. Win. Hey, Sarah, Thanks for the follow, man. Huge thanks. Really appreciate it. Uh, just playing some Breath of Fire 4. Um, it's a pretty fun game. I just remember those goo enemies in the beginning of the game had fire spells. Don't know if there's any others. Okay. Well, I could go back because of the way this game works. Um, so I could go back and do that. But I do want to find a shop uh, where I can find, buy some items that, you know, help me with revival and things. I think this is the end. Appreciate it, man. Huge thanks for the follow, dude. Uh, no, that's not a shop. Are you going to stream later, Sarah? Because you stream, right? 
I meant to ask that yesterday in chat, but I forgot. That's the orphanage. There's gotta be a shop somewhere around here. Somewhere around here where I can buy something. I mean, I guess technically there doesn't have to be, but it'd be really nice if there was. Here we go. Healing herb. That cures poison. Cures mutinous. You're going to stream about 15 minutes. What are you streaming? Sticker of Evermore. Ooh, that's a good one. I never beat that game. Um, it was just weird to me. I like the idea of it. Thought it was pretty cool. They have nothing that does revival. That's that's annoying. Remember what I learned earn from my performances. Okie dokie. I've heard that one of the merchants here has some kind of deal with the empire. I wonder what kind of person would do business with their enemy. He must be very brave or very greedy. He did have ammonia. Did I miss it? Or did I just see it and read it wrong? Oh, there it is. Golly. Man, I am blind as a bat. They're expensive. But I need them. I know I will. So I'm going to buy them regardless hopefully I'll earn back some cash in the um, in the dungeon here where would I be without you just ask helping me out making sure I catch stuff because I'm blind can't read I'm wondering if I should go go back and learn that fire spell from um, from those dudes. You like Breath of Fire a lot? I never played three. I know. I, I'm actually gonna go back and. Uh, is it a good idea to go back? I'm, I'm gonna go back. Cause I wanna learn that combo spell. Um, it probably won't take very long. It's the magic dudes, correct? The, the red ones you said? the gate the gate was near there it is yeah the red jelly things cool all right I'm gonna go I'm gonna go get the fire spell because I want it um, I think I can just go in places like this I don't think I was ever in here before or is this where I met that dragon? I think that's where I saw the the dragon. The one I thought was gonna kill me, but I actually just wanted to communicate. That's the dam. Here we go. I think I can just fight him in here. Come on, give me a battle with some jellies. Red jellies, let's go. Hey, hey, there's one. Uh, I'm gonna kill this guy, and then I'm gonna guard, and then I'm gonna attack the bandits. Kill the bandits. Kill the bandits. Oh, he can do sever? That's not cool.
Oh, you can probably hear my daughter. There it is, burn. That's it. Did you learn it? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Let's get it. Uh, I want to try it. So I have to do fire first and then win, right? Fire plus win. Okay. I'm going to check it out. So that, and we're going to do it on this guy, and then we're going to do her, and then sever. All right, here we go. Don't do that. All right, he's dead. Oh, 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 that was dope. That was strong. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I am talking about. Alright, cool. So we'll leave here. Go back to town. Um, go sleep at the end. Or in. End. Uh, save. And then, and then we'll continue on. Now that I got fire and wind. Let me ask you this, just ask. Um, when those question marks pop up, are there specific ones that I should be looking for that might have items in it? Or is it just random if they have items? Yep, the rest. All of them have items? Are there some that's like, more important than others. Like locations on the map. Keep an eye on recurring question marks in the same spot. Those could be pathways to hidden fishing spots. Ah, is that important? Is fishing important in this game? Or is it just a mini game? Something you can do. Cucarachas. Ooh, I got a feeling that's like a, a move I can learn. Too bad he's dead. Fishing is an extra mini game. You can trade fish to rare items, but it takes a really long time to catch good fish. I don't know if I want to put that kind of time into it. <clears throat> um... So I was on Discord the other day, and I was talking to a fellow streamer, um, Background Gaming, and he was wanting me to stream Pokemon for the first time, because I've never played a Pokemon game. And I don't know how big um, you are into to Pokemon, but he was very like, you know, you should stream Pokemon for the first time and like I want to see you stream it like blind so I was like okay so I downloaded uh, that so I can give it a give it a try I got fire red I got the remake of red for Game Boy so I'll be trying that it won't be um, I want him to guard it won't be any time until after I beat this so we definitely got time before before I stream fire red but it is something that I want to do. Yeah. <laughs> Same for me, man. I know absolutely nothing about Pokemon. Um, my son plays Pokemon. Like, he played the... Okay, so that's not learned. Um, I felt like that would be. Jump. But anyway, uh, I know absolutely nothing about Pokemon. My son's got cards. Uh, he's got the most recent game. 
He's also got like Soul Silver or Plat Platinum or something on 3DS, uh, and he plays it. He likes it, but it's just not something I ever got into. Growing up as a kid, my best friend got uh, got Red for a Game Boy, so I know about the OG games, but it's just not something I really got into. I couldn't get into the idea of catching monsters and having them fight for you and it just seems so kiddish like not the idea of catching monsters just the idea of that like the way they played it out it just seemed like a kid catching monsters uh and fighting other other pokemon and the way they portrayed it in the game or in the cartoon was just very kiddish and i was a teenager at the time so obviously i didn't Pokemon, that's for kids. So that's not something I was really into. That same learn. I'm gonna try and guard that to see if that's Come on, do it again. Don't do that again. Do the, do the bitey thing. Of course, now he's not going to do it. It, like, dropped its defense. Dropped my defense. That's pretty cool. Snap. Yeah, it is learnable. I was right. Yay, look at me learning stuff. Oh, but he didn't learn it? Oh, come on. No one learned snap. And then it left. Are you kidding me? Whoops. Wrong button. Well, there's mice in here. That's, I mean, that's something I can learn. What's, oh, he got, look at that. He got trapped. He's stuck down here. There's a barrel caught in the door. You won't be able to get it open while it's in the way. Okay, so this one opens. Raptor claws. Ooh. I swear if I don't stop hitting triangle. Um... Okay, so he gets... Raptor Claws. I never equipped Flame Punch. Look at me being a noob. I'm assuming I can't, like, push it through the... Yeah. I have to get it from the, uh... From the other side, or, like, f fall through the ceiling, I guess. Yeah, look at that. So he's below me there. If I fall through here, I should end up in the other one. Yeah, okay. Just double checking. So let's fall through this hole. Yeah, there we go. All right, we found him. Drat, you found me. I thought no one would be able to find me here. Did I miss something because I found him? All right then, Chino. Will you tell me about the princess now? Okay, deal's a deal. When the princess, did I tell you how pretty she was? Anyway, when she was getting ready to leave town. I followed her. I ran after her all the way to the gate. When I got there, I saw these people come up and start talking to her. What? Who was it? Who was there? Tell me. 
I don't really know, but one of them was Marlock, the shop owner. Oh, that guy. Marlock is a merchant who lives here in the town. He owns a large sand flyer of his own. Some people say he's even even has dealings with the Empire. The Empire? You mean Alina's been taken to the West? Excuse me, sister, but do you think you could tell us where? We can find this Marlock? Marlock's got this big house right in the middle of town. He's got a bodyguard, too, who stands in front of it. Looks like we should have a little talk with this Marlock. Thanks for your help. So, looks like now I gotta figure out a way to get in there, because that bodyguard's guarding the door. Is there a back door entrance? Yeah, let's let's at least go up to the door and talk to the guy and see what he has to say. Where was he? That's the gate. I think it was like right here. Yeah. This house belongs to the magnificent Mar. What? You want to meet with Mr. Marlock? No way. Forget it. Why has he got a giant grin on his face? He is extremely happy to be doing his job. He doesn't meet with anyone but his business partners. If you're not selling or buying something, he won't see you. Well, maybe I'll buy something. If you insist, you're going to have to go through me. Oh, I got a battle here. Okay. I was not prepared. Um, I want to see if he's got anything to learn. Man, his neck is huge when he shouts. Focus, there we go. Knew there was something to learn. Attack up. Alright, he learned it. Nice. Alright, so I'm actually going to pull Urshan out, and we're going to do burn. No, wait. I'm actually going to attack real quick, and then, yeah, we're going to attack. How was he on HP? Yeah, he's fine. No, we'll attack again. A whole seven guarding. I'm not sure if there's anything I can break his guard with. Maybe magic. Okay, so let's burn and then sever and then let's try rock blast. Oh, ow, that, wow, that was painful. Did I do that wrong? This is fire and wind. Or is there a chance for it to not do it? Let's try it again. Actually, that's not, because she needs to heal. Um... if I can confuse him. He's probably not susceptible to that. And wait. Rejuvenate. Her. Oh, he broke my combo with punch. Well, that's lame. He's confused. All right. Now just hit yourself. So he's not uh, immune to confusion. It's good to know. I wonder if I do the spell again, do burn, and then sever, and then uh, let's protect her. 
I didn't either. And generally in these games you can't. But, you know, there's always a chance. Yeah, there we go. Is he still confused or no? Well, I guess not. I think he's out of confusion now. I want to see if I can confuse him again. If that's like a perpetual thing that I can just keep doing so I avoid damage. Um, let's see. Purify. That just cured poison. Let's bring in... Uh, rear guard focus counter up. Let's keep, actually keep her in for a minute. Or no. Let's bring him in. And then we're gonna focus him. Earth fire is also a combo. Okay, I'll do it after, um, after this. I don't want him to attack. Because I wanna, I wanna confuse him. Hopefully it does. Ah, it missed. Boo! Okay, so you said Earth Fire. So Rock Blast. And then burn. Let's try that. And then uh, we'll have him attack. Let's give it a shot. It's like EQ earthquake. Eruption. Good call, man. Good call. Whoa. Big damage. Big damage. Nice. Three eight six. Well, that's dope. Glad that works. Um, let's bring her in, and then I'm gonna have her. Hmm. Actually, no. Let's, let's do it this way. Special burn. And then special sever. So they do that together. And then that's attack again. That combo stuff is awesome. That's super handy. It does real good damage. This thing's got this guy's got a buttload of HP. Big crit. Now he's guarding. So I'm assuming if I go to attack him now, um, Something bad gonna happen. So what if I guard out of it? I'm like wait for him to drop his guard. Now I'm assuming it's dropped after one turn. I could be wrong. Let's try. Defeated the enemy. Thousand XP. Nice. 
Level 10, level 12. Ginseng. Okay. It's a frog pirate. My, my. Very impressive, my friends. Ribbit. I am Marlock. You're wanted to s you wanted to see me? Yes? Well then, come inside so that we can talk. Oh, he's French. At least I'm assuming he's French. What? A Windian princess, you say? Now that you mention it, I did carry a person who looked like Zat on my sand flyer. What did you do with her? Non, non, my little birdie, you misunderstand. I was asked to take her to the west, you see. Listen, mister, you better start making sense and fast. Tell us exactly what happened now. There is nothing to tell. The Empire asked the princess to come to the capital. A lot of Z's. What the? Why would Elena go there, huh? What reason would she have to go to the heart of the enemy's country? He just casually puffs on his cigarette. You're asking the wrong person, eh? Besides, I am thinking that you will be wanting my help and looking for the princess, no? If that is so, then I think you should be a little more polite, eh? But I have a terrible French accent. <laughs> well, if you're wanting my help, I am not an unreasonable man, but before I help you, I need you to do some work for me, as always. That's how it always goes down. You want some shit done, you gotta help them out first. So he wants us to go catch some thief, huh? Merchants. They can't talk, they can't think about anything but money. We're trying to find a missing princess, and he sends us off to find his missing money. What does he think we are, anyway? Handyman or something? Eh, <laughs> he just laughs. I'm telling you, man, there's somebody in that robot suit. There's gotta be. Robots don't have emotions. Urshan reminds me that we were responsible for the loss of his bodyguard. <laughs> and she says that it is unrealistic to expect someone like Marlock to provide us with services for no cost. You have a point, however. Uh, well, I guess you've got a point. Still, I think it's asking a little much to have us leave Nina behind like that. She's a princess herself, not a maid. So now I gotta rock this without Nina? Um, Mr. Marlock, what exactly is it that you um, want me to do? Just puffing away. Hmm. Well, until your friends come back with the items that were stolen from me, I was thinking that that maybe you could some work around, you know, help take care of the house and me. Man, that was hard to read. <laughs> if I just read it normally, I wouldn't have had a problem. Sounds like some stuff's about to go down with her and uh, Marlock there. Gross, a frog. That's disgusting. Well, anyway, we should probably think of what to do next. I've been told that we should find the thief as quickly as possible, that we may return and continue on our mission without further delay. You think? All right, then. Let's go ask some of those traveling merchants if they know anything about this thief. All right, so there's this guy in the green hat. I need to repair my house. Can't you give me a, even a little discount? I've heard that one of the merchants here has some kind of deal with the Empire. I wonder what kind of person would do business with their enemy. He must be very brave or very greedy. So I talked to that guy a minute ago and it was kind of the same thing. Are all these dudes merchants? We carry everything he goes from the Empire. Never mind, he's actually a merchant. What about this guy. Marlock was robbed? I guess you could call it poetic justice. 
I've heard people say he's a thief himself. This town suffered the most during the war. A lot of people were injured or killed. I heard some princess or something came on a goodwill visit a while ago to help lift people's spirits. Okay, so... Really doesn't help there. What? A bandit? Well, I don't know if he's the man you're looking for, but I saw a fellow with a big, heavy-looking bag over his shoulder heading out of town on the Eastern Highway. Ooh. There we go. Eastern Highway. Looks like I found a clue. Here we go. Hideout. And I got no healer, so that's just fantastic. You know what? Actually, before we get started here, I am going to save. <laughs> I should probably sleep in the inn and save. That's probably a better idea. This how's everybody's HP doing? Yeah, kind of low. Oops. So I'm going to go sleep at the inn. Nah, I keep going. And then, uh, and then go to the hideout. Do, 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 do. Love this music, man. I like this game. This game's so cool. Yep. I want to stay. And then I'm going to save, and then we'll move on. To the hideout. Make sure that really, yeah, it did. Okay. Um, how are we looking at for items? We got 15 healing herbs. That'll probably push me through the the hideout, or the dungeon, or whatever it is. Okay. Here we go. Doom, 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 doom. Let's go this way. A barrel of monkeys. I'm not sure if there's any treasures in here or even um, random encounters. I'm assuming there'd be random encounters. Yep, there are. There we go. All right. Bats. I don't think these bats have anything. To learn. They're also super weak. 1746. Big damage. One hit kills. Nice. And they're super slow. They don't even get it. Doom doom. Huh. Lots of barrels. All over. I'm assuming there's got to be an entrance, an another entrance to somewhere. Because that's the exit. That's where I came in. That was a crit. A little unnecessary. But I'll take it. A whole 12. I feel like I should do something with the barrels. Like he can push them. I don't think I can do anything with the boxes. Can I not move this barrel? I need to push it somewhere. Huh. Um, I don't think I learned 
Yeah, I didn't learn what they could give me. Snap this. I tried to learn it, but then it, Urshan didn't learn it because he's dummy. You're a dummy. Learn it. You had two opportunities there, and you didn't learn it. Can she not learn anything? Um, I'll just have everybody guard until Snap is learned. Uh, or not. Or it'll just leave. Fantastic. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. I wanted to get in that battle and waste my time. Gain half the experience I could have gained. Can I smash the barrels? Like with Urshan? I can't smash them. And I can't... He can cut things. But he can't cut boxes because he's not Link. Ooh, it's a, a white... Oh, it's a rat. Okay. Hiya! Hiya! Oh, the rat left. Okay, you better learn it. Does it have to be done to him? Okay, it was done to him, so he's got to learn it. Why is it so tough to learn? I don't understand. I didn't learn Snap yet. Of course it left. Just ask if you have any idea what I'm supposed to do in here. Feel free. I feel like I'm supposed to do something with the barrels. Whether that be push them or place them somewhere. Yeah, yeah, I gotta find the bandit. And they told me he went into this area. Do snap. Learn snap. Someone learn snap. Oh. Did he learn it? Finally, someone learned snap. Whoops. No. Of course it left. Okay, so at least somebody learned snap, but I still gotta figure out what to do here. And I can't pull barrels. Or can I? No. I can hold barrels. Oops. Wrong button. I think the barrels are for later on. There's nowhere else to go in here, though. Unless I'm just supposed to leave? Like, oh, he's not in here. You think it... You remember it being some kind of mini game? Hmm, okay. Maybe that guy back at the... Back at the town just gave me general information. Not really an exact location of where the bandit is. Because there's nowhere else to go but... But there, I think. 
Yeah, hide out. So this guy at the front, in the front of Sinesta, kind of told me about the bandit. This guy here. What? A bandit? Well, I don't know if he he's the man you're looking for, but I saw a fellow with a big heavy looking bag over his shoulder heading out of town on the Eastern Highway. So I gotta find the Eastern Highway. Right? I mean, that's... And the only other, I'm going east, that's east. But I don't know if there's any other direction I can go out of a different town. Because there's nothing else to do in here. It's just this room with the barrels. So I'm thinking I'm in the... Okay, on the way to the hideout. All right, I got you. Like in one of these. Aha, uh -huh, see? That's why you're here. Hmm. If it's true what they say about there being bandits in these parts, and you were a merchant, you wouldn't just be out walking with all your goods out in the open, would you? Ho oh, there. Where are you folks headed to? What's that? Bandits? Hmm, nope. Haven't heard anything about that. Liar. Oh. See, we were asked by a merchant in Sinesta named Marlock. Marlock? <laughs> and there he goes. So this must mean the minigame thing is probably up next. Wait a minute. You mean he was the thief Marlock was talking about? Of course he was. It's the only other person here. Oh boy, here we go. Let me see. For now, why don't you rub me sh shoulders here, eh? What a perv. This is where he ran into. See, if I would've just hung out in the hideout long enough, he would've, he would've showed up. Catch the thief. To catch the thief, get close to him and press the X button. He's fast and hard to catch. Try blocking the p passageways. Uh, nope. So. Let me take this one and block here and then let me go to here oh there's still random battles I want I, I know he's got some unless he's just gonna flee yeah he flees so apparently the rat either is worth a buttload of experience or he's got an item. So next time I run into the rat, I'm gonna try and uh, try and kill him, I guess. All right, so we're gonna block this path here. Then we're gonna go around. I can squeeze through here, can I? I can. Oh. Okie dokie. He can still squeeze through there, but it takes him a second. I wonder if these bats are called mini bats. I wonder if they wear camouflage. No, they don't. You know why they don't? Because we can see them. You won a great victory. How's it really that great? It's just a bunch of bats. Once I catch this guy, now that's a great victory. Can I trap him here? Oh, he is fast. Oh, oh. Um, what should I do with this barrel? I got it. 
since he is here, I'm gonna trap him in this hole right here. I kind of wish the camera was this far away in the regular game. That way I can see a little bit more of the area. Come on, give me the rat again. Kill the rat. Cray with that little slugger. I think I'm gonna get him in here. Yeah. Oh, what? You see that guy? He, ju he straight up juked me. Never seen anybody move like that. He straight up juked me. I did it again. Oh, there's the rat. Oh, he parried my attack. He parried my attack. He parried my attack. And he left. Really? That was not cool. You can't parry all three attacks and then leave. That's rude. Please let me get one hit in. Alright, no, no, no. Don't go that way. I want to trap you on the other side. Um... Can I keep him there and then push this barrel in there? I can't do anything with the blocks. I have to do it with the barrels. Nice crit. Seven two. And of course, Cray doesn't need a crit. Big five four zero. All right, I'm gonna try see if it's no, because once I get into the corner here. I'm not gonna be able to push it that direction. Right, he's gonna juke me again, I know it. Oh, he juked me. Again, he's got the moves, man. Don't go that way. Come back here. Okay, that's fine. This guy's tough to catch. This guy is tough to catch, nice counter. Nice. Thurston leveled, sweet. All right, all right. There's got to be a, a better strat for this. Look at him. Look at him go. He's so fast. It's like Sonic. He's stuck. Get him. Uh, I touched him. I touched him and hit X. I don't know what button I'm supposed to push to get him to stop running. <laughs> there he goes again. Come on. Squeeze it in there. Oh, oh, oh. You see him? He's shifty. He's shifty. He's sh oh. He is worse than Chino. Way worse than Chino. At least with this one, I get a nice pulled back overhead view. But Chino is just kind of blind luck, she called him. Or at least it felt like it. I'm assuming X is the button you push once you get close enough to him. Okay, okay, okay. Let's try this. I'm getting him caught in that corner, though, which is, you know, where I want him to be. It's almost better if I put him, put him down there. Uh, uh. Uh, 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 yeah. No. <laughs> Quit it. I need this barrel, like, up there, but I can't get it up there. Just because if I push it any more further forward, he can push barrels, but he can't pull them. get this guy must be Chino's dad it's Chino's real dad that's what's actually happening right now Chino's an orphan but it's because this guy could outrun him that's sad Go. 
The guy mashing X. And he still runs right by me. I just, I'm just awful at this. What if I became Ryu and used Ryu and like slashed him? Once I got him stuck in that hole and got him that close again. I'm not sure if it'll make a difference, but. Probably gonna hear my dog right now. Garbage man is pulling up. She is very loud. Go back in the hole. Go back over there. Get. Nah. There we go. Alright, let's get him uh, caught doing that uh, bouncing back and forth again. Really? You missed. Hey. Wow. Huge damage. I would have started streaming earlier, but um, I had to go fix a computer. This is actually kind of annoying. <laughs> I'm eventually gonna get this guy. At the end of stream is when I'll get this guy. I think I'm just supposed to trap him in some way. But he keeps blowing by me. No, I got him that time. All right, let, let me go. This is my stuff. It just spun around. I need, yeah, appreciate it. I needed that. So what you're saying is, that was all yours to begin with? That Marlock sent these really big fellows after me. Made me sell them everything for next to nothing. What are you doing, Urshan? It's supposed to be serious, and you're playing games with your cape. Hmm, I guess it's not really stealing if you're just at taking what's already yours. Looks like we need to go back and have a little talk with Marlock. But who... So, yes, it could be his. Okay, could be. But who's to say? Who's to say? That's Chino's dad, and he left him. So he's dead beat. So that probably isn't his stuff, and it was Marlock's anyway. That's what I'm going with. Enough with these shoulders. Now why don't you give me a foot massage? Mm. What a weirdo. <laughs> okay, so let's go have a talk with uh, with Mr. Marlock here. There's always something that pops up here. Every time I take a couple steps out of town there, a que well, not every time, but a lot of the time, a question mark pops up. I don't know if because that's... Oh boy, that is a lot of caps. Let's take out the red one. It's dead. Now the other caps don't have to do because he can't give... They can't get orders. Or they can know what to do. Just based on sheer instinct. Let's see. Item. If I can pick it up. Pick up the item. Eye drops. Okay. Let's go talk to talk to our homeboy here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Um, I thought about resting. What? And so you came back, just like that, eh? You didn't tell us the whole story. According to that man, you were the one who... Idiot. No matter how much I pay for it, what's mine is mine. I have a right to get it back, yes? Never mind. Alright, Zen. This time, I have you do some work where thinking is not required, yes? Ooh. Ooh, what a burn. He called us dumb. Do some work where thinking is not required. Bah! Who does he think he is, anyway? Fat, greedy son of a... Thinks he's smarter than us. Quit it, Urson. Urshan says that we did fail our first job assignment to us. She also says it is un unrealistic of you to expect to be given something for nothing. It always feels like she's yelling at us. When, like the, the little pixel picture at the bottom. Whenever it gets closer and her eyes get red. All right, all right, I get your point. Poor Nina. Because of me, she has to do even more work. Gross, disgusting work. That only frogs enjoy. <laughs> like he's thinking about it. Very good, Miss Nina. Now, how about a back massage? At least they're just massages. Well, it's no use standing around here moping about it all day. I've been told that we should complete our assigned task as quickly as possible that we may return and continue on our mission without further delay. You're right. He said we should go to the Sandflyer Wharf north of here, right? Let's go. Alright, here we go. Sandflyer Wharf. Here we go. Hello, guy. Talk to me. Talk. I guess no one wants to talk to me. The dog guy will. Oh dear, oh dear. There's so much to do and so little time. Oh dear. Is that a reference? That seems like a reference. <laughs> Go talk to this guy. What's that you say? You're here to help? Well then, let's not waste any time. I've got a job for you right here. First, I need you to clean up the storeroom. You need to move all the barrels and jars and line them up where they're supposed to go. We don't need the old barrels anymore, so you can just break them if they get in the way. Pretty simple, huh? All right, get to it. It's like another mini game. Yeah, let's read the instructions. Put Cray in front and have him and use him to move the jars and barrels. The jars need to be put in front of the sign in the north end of the room. And the barrels need to be put in front of the sign in the south end of the room. To get the old barrels out of the way, put Urshan in front and press triangle button to destroy them. Move all the jars and barrels quickly enough and you might earn a bonus. Yeah, that's not happening. One way to finish the job quickly would be to move one jar and one barrel and then destroy the rest. If you leave the room, all the jars and barrels will be reset. Okay, so here we go. Watch how bad this is going to be. Now ready? Um, jars and... That's the old barrels, right? Okay, that's the barrel. And there's... Or is there only... Uh, cockroaches. Figures. There's encounters inside the old barrels. Two 
hits didn't take him out? Or did he only hit him once? I think I only hit him once. That was slow. Took forever to come back. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Oh no! Why did he do that? Yeah, yeah, let's let's leave since I screwed up. Let's try again. <laughs> try one more time. So barrels and jars. Jars need to be put in the north end of the room. In front of the sign in the north end of the room. And barrels at the south. So jars, north, barrels, south. Jars, jars north, barrels south. Barrel storage area. Okay. Ah, I got it. Okay. Let's see. Um. How am I supposed to get up there? Oh, I guess I gotta go around this way. Oh, can I just push this down? I can. Sorry, I gotta concentrate. And now I have a dog barking in the background. It's not gonna be very easy to concentrate, is it? No. Hit the wrong button. I'm assuming all of them have to go there. Come on. Supposed to oh, I'm dumb. That's that's how. Hmm. I think I just screwed up. I would like to move this out of the way, but I don't think I can. Because how am I supposed to get that in? How am I supposed to move that? done but we have half our stuff well you didn't say you needed all of it moved i got a 
message. Hang on. His cockroach is strong. Really? Urson? Come on, bro. So I'm gonna break it, and then I'm gonna switch to. Uh, come on. And push it down here. But as soon as I get it there, yeah, I don't. Well, what the heck? Let's see what happens. Yes. What if I talk to the guy? Or does it... Or did, like, it doesn't count. <laughs> I guess it doesn't count. So I have to do all of them. No. Um, let's push this one all the way around. Or can I? I can't. No, I don't want to leave. No! But I can't push it anymore. the stairs and push it forward from standing up on the stairs. Okay, I think I know what you're talking about. If not, I can only reset the room. Do it again. And sometimes these barrel fights, they, uh, Take a minute to load back in. He learned slow. Nice. I think I already messed up with that metal jar. Yeah. I'll go reset the reset the room. Whoops. Okay. No. So you're saying pushed towards the stairs, like that, and then push it forward from standing on the stairs, push it down first, like off the ledge, and then push it towards the stairs. And then like push it all, all the way around. No, because then I can't. Because I can't get it from there. Okay, hang on. Should have stopped at the stair with it and push it off the wall while standing on the stairs. So you're saying push it off the wall.
Oh, I think I know what you're talking about. Push it off the wall. Go to this side. Push it until it's away from the... Can I push it up the stairs? I can. Okay, so I can push it up the stairs. But I think I screwed it up. I think if I push it off the wall and then push it up the... Because it looks like there's two... No, I don't want to read the instructions. <clears throat> ah, no, I didn't want to leave. No, don't want to read this, the instructions. No, I don't want to leave. So push it off the, the ledge. Come to this side. Push it that way. Let's break this barrel. Get into this fight. And then go up the stairs and push it forward. I think it's what you're saying. Die, cockroach, die. Raid. Don't do that. Okay, nice. Didn't really do much damage. Okay. So if I go around, switch back. Oops. And then push it this way. And then if I push it to here, then I can push it away over here and then up. Okay, I think I got it. Push it here, come back here, push it here. Like I'm nervous to get it close to anything. Um, yeah, because there's a space there. I'm going to have to break this barrel so I can push it through. So let's go ahead and break this barrel. Of course, there's a battle in there. Is this what you were thinking too, or no? Am I like way off still? Okay, cool. It took me a while to see it, but I saw it. This way, and then this way, this way, break this barrel. Of course, there's an enemy in there. This is harder than it looks. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's not hard, it's just, it can be confusing, I guess, if you're a moron like I am. Um, I want to heal. Heal Cray real quick. I don't want him to go down. Don't do jump. Yeah, I agree there. They should have zoomed out the camera there. I think the camera in general needs to be pulled out just a little bit further. Just the, because of the placement of, of things. Okay, so now I can push this one straight on through. And then 
I want to go ahead and destroy this barrel. So I'm pretty sure I can destroy it. It's old barrel. I don't need it. Probably gonna have to finish this puzzle and, and um, end stream so I can go get my kids again for the day. Okay, so I'm gonna push this over here in the corner out of the way and then push this one in the corner out of the way. Okay, so I think we got that. There's four jars and four barrels. So. Um, honestly, I think the rest of it is kind of self-explanatory, isn't it? I'm a little nervous about that one, though. So I think before I push that barrel off, I want to push the jar off. Don't move any wooden barrels towards the jar area because they'll get stuck in there, I think. Yeah, uh, I think you're right. I think if I push the jar off the top and take the same path I did with the first jar, I think I'll be okay. So if I push that off and go back, and then ignore that barrel, come back down, and then basically do the same thing I did for this one. Or for the first one. For this one. It's almost like I need to do the jars first and then the barrels. The only one that's got me a little bit concerned is this barrel here. So I think what I need to do is get this barrel in position. But what was what I'm concerned with is this giant box is in the way. Because I need to get that barrel there out. If I push it in there, if I push it one space, that's not going to go. That's not going to go. I'm trying to visualize all this before make any moves um, I think if I push this jar because my first instinct is to move that barrel forward but then I'll get it stuck so I think I need to go all the way around with it so I think that's what I'm going to do screwed up. No, okay, I can move through there. I think I might have got the, at least the jar situation figured out, maybe. I just screwed up because I can't move any of those away from the wall and since Kraza a, a pansy can't pull them he has to push them only uh, that sucks well that's lame well here's what's got to happen um, that's going to be the end of the stream for now. i got to go get my kids. Um, but once again, just ask. Thanks for coming out the stream. I really appreciate you. We didn't have any hiccups with stream this time. It's freaking awesome. Um, uh, 
uh, I want to thank uh, the Sarai for uh, all the help too and coming out and just you know following and all that stuff that's awesome so that's a huge thanks to everybody for coming out and checking out stream tomorrow I'll, I'll probably be back doing it again uh, we'll continue where we left off and hopefully I'll get this stupid puzzle down and then um, uh, we'll move on but thanks for coming out and hopefully I will see you guys in the next one